This is the TC1 component tester. It can test almost any component, um, resistors, inductors, capacitors, transistors, MOSFETs, diodes. To use it is very simple. You simply take the component, connect it to the, its legs to two different numbered pins. So not to two and two, for example, to anything else, one and three, one and two, so in this case, I'm connecting it to 1 and 2, like that. And I'm closing this lever to clamp it. And then I just switch it on. It's testing, and there it tells me it's a resistor of 9.962K. It's a 10K resistor. So I'm going to test a different component, this time a diode. Um, it also has the... Okay, so uh, 2 and... Just make this two and three. And I press the test button again or the start button. It tells me that's the anode, uh, that's the cathode, that's the anode. This is the forward voltage, 669 millivolts. Um, that's even the capacitance and the, uh, it, the test current or the leakage current it gives you this. So it's very complete, very useful. It's, uh, it also uses an internal uh, rechargeable battery that you charge there with a micro USB cable. So let me do one last test. Um, this is an NPN transistor. I'm going to connect it to pins 1, 2 and 3. You don't have to worry about knowing which pin is which. The tester will determine that for you. Enter, run and start and the Gives me the pinouts, collector is on pin, on, on pin 1 here, uh, base is on pin 2, emitter on pin 3, it's an NPN transistor, that's the HFE, um, that's the VBE voltage, 768 millivolts, so yeah, great tool. And then lastly, you get it with these cables, so that you can clamp them onto a component that is sitting on a PC board so you don't have to unsolder or remove the component to put it in here. You can just simply clamp these cables on there and you also get it with a micro USB cable and some test components.